Hello, my friends. Today I'm going to show you the defroster grid I made for my 40 year old car. The car originally never had a defroster grid, so you always have to wipe it off or scratch it away. Let's turn on the ignition. Come on. It's made of thin copper tape lines connected in series. I didn't want to use any sort of uh, current control and to avoid them melting I had to make sure that they don't consume more than three and a half amps I still need a bit of space to cover but I ran out of material so let's see maybe I'll need to start the car because it needs it's calculated for 14 volts and I think that now I only got 12 see the coolant temperature the dashboard is not original nothing actually almost is original because it's just you can't use a car like that as everyday car if you don't modify it at least a bit so Let's see if it's going to work or not. Maybe it's going to take a while because the condensation is on the outer side of the window and it's probably going to take a while. Here, fans working. We installed extraction fans. In the summer, if you turn them on, they keep the car cool if you leave it in the sun. probably need to start the engine you can see the other windows you can barely see through them but okay we're back and now you can actually start to see the result I think I really need to adjust current to make it a bit warmer because it takes a while but you can see how it looks through the grid how it looks down when there is no grid I'm quite happy with the result but I ran out of copper tape so I'm going to try to finish the rest with aluminium you can still solder on aluminium tape, so I will make an update video <coughs> when it's time to show the results. Here it is, you can see how it's here through the grid, how it's down when there is no grid. Again, this car never had a grid originally and every winter was horrible for me. You need to scrape it on the outside. You need to wait for the coolant to get warmer in order to turn on the heating and wait for the all inside of the car to get warm up because originally this car blows all there through here it goes here near the roof and then goes down blows on the rear, rear window 
and then goes out through these exhausts. So, as you know, it's going to take quite a while every morning. But now, my window is perfectly clean. My coolant is just above 40 degrees. You can see it from the outside. So, everybody can try the lab, if you get the, the patients, I just cut them with scissors, they're like 2-3 millimeters, they're not perfectly aligned or anything. 